Tonight, Judson ISD's board voted to delay the start of the school year by a week until August 24th. For the safety of students, November 3rd, Election Day, campuses will be closed. That's because a lot of those campus buildings are used as voting sites. The 19th's Patty Santos tells us the board also heard the detailed safety plan. Schools will be a lot different for students once face-to-face -face learning begins. So the bus is going to be sanitized at least six times during the day. Cleanliness and social distancing will begin as soon as a student enters a Judson ISD bus. And our driver has a bottle that they're going to be able to spray the sanitizer on them as they board the buses. Kids fourth grade and up will be required to wear masks on the bus. Stops and routes have been reworked to cut the number of riders in half. Right now we're lowering it down to about, uh, about 26 students on a bus. If siblings ride the bus, they can put more than one to a seat. More than 200 custodians will be in charge of cleaning 45 plus buildings once face to face learning begins. We will be going into each classroom and cleaning in each bathroom and doing things in between each class period on a continual basis throughout the day. They've had a busy summer cleaning classrooms and hallways, but the true test starts when students arrive. Well, our eyes are going to be open more to ensure that restrooms are cleaned and remain clean on a regular basis. Classrooms, door knobs, door jams are being wiped down on a regular basis. The district tells us they have not hired any additional staff for the transportation or maintenance department. They have simply shifted some schedules around and added some responsibilities to some job titles. Patty Santos, KSAT 12 News.